Hey, what's up guys? It's Josh here. I'm just making a video about my recent haul. I went to McMinnville, Oregon with my little brother. He wanted to look at a truck and ended up not buying it. But on the way we had to hit a few yard sales. I uh, had a couple Goodwills. Goodwills were trash. Sorry, Goodwill. And uh, a couple of the smaller thrift stores in McMinnville. So let's get into what I what I picked up and what I'm going to be putting up for sale here. Soon. Yard sale. Um, no souls, but it looks like People have them listed for like $150. I'll probably put mine at like at 100 I don't know. It's kind of heavy. So um, it's, it's just a dollar little um, Charmander. I don't know. Probably $15. Same with this guy. It was $1, $15. This vintage Cabela's hat isn't on eBay. So I don't really know the comps. Probably 25 bucks, But it is a made in USA. It is vintage. Uh, Tigger here. I think he goes for about 40 uh, these are just some John Deere's. I don't believe these are the older ones. I believe with John Deere, their back legs are up and not down like that, if I remember correctly. Someone can correct me if I'm wrong on that. But I think these are two newer ones, so I'm thinking about 20 bucks max on those guys. This is a Lenard's um, Jeep from the 1990s. They sell for about $40, and all the figures are either Star Wars from the 90s or Lennard figures from the 80s, which lots of those look like they go for around 30 to 35 um, This is from Tarzan. Um, probably 15 bucks on that guy. $12. This is a, um, what was it? All Dogs Go to Heaven, but it's like a Christmas Carol thing. <laughs> and then this little plush Halloween guy. Halloween's on its way, so I should get about 25 or 30 on that. These are all 1974 or excuse me 75 imperial horses i should get about 15 each on these guys so at six items 15 a piece that's pretty good uh bop it i just got for three dollars this sells for around 15. uh this scanned on amazon for 32 dollars this guy i couldn't find any comps on but i don't know 10 15 bucks probably thought it was cool <laughs> this also sold uh scanned for 32 on uh amazon and that one scanned for 20 on Amazon, so pretty good Amazon stuff. Uh, these James Cook playing cards, kind of random, but there was a sold comp for some used one used pack for 10 bucks. So figure two in the package might get me 20-25. This uh, anime book sold for 25 dollars. These guys sell for around 20. They're from the 80s. Ducktales Jello molds, old Scoob. I should get about 30 for Scoob with the tag. I got two of these Nike Pro Combat Giants shirts. Um, I'm, I don't know if I'm going to lot them together or sell them separately, but I should get about $25 a piece. Uh, Nike shirt, probably around $20. Uh, this, last Alabama, this is a 3XL Nike, the last Alabama hoodie, the 3XL sold for $50. So hopefully I can get that for this. That'd be one of my better finds. Uh, Tony Romo jersey, um, probably $35 on that guy, hopefully. And then another 30, 35. This is a 2XL. Bigger sizes do sell better if you're new to reselling. Look for the bigger sizes. And then I got these two cute little dragon guys. I don't know what they're worth. I could not find a comp on them. So, yeah, maybe $20 a piece. And then another one of those Lennard 1990 um, Jeeps with another Star Wars figure in the back and a couple more of the 1980s figures. And then the last thing is this um, Christmas Story leg lamp. <laughs> Uh, blanket, I don't know. I should probably get like 30 to 40 bucks for it, I'm guessing. <laughs> but that's all for today, guys. This stuff will all be for sale on my uh, website at jtsheroshop.com. If you want to go check that out, I would really appreciate it. And uh, thanks for tuning in.